my name is Muywa Desoya. I'm the first son of Mama. And uh, each time she travels with me, we go up to the U.S. and I bring her back. She enjoys flying with me and she likes coming to the U.S. for holidays. And uh, all she does is she enjoys America. And uh, each time we fly, she says, she at Debeni. Why is it so long? That's what she always say. And I enjoy that a lot in her. And she's very caring. She has five kids and she has 22 grandchildren. And she has 25, 25 great grandchildren. And uh, most of them are here. And whenever she travels abroad, she stays in the homes of all these kids. And I enjoy what she does all the time. Hello. Uh, my name is Sumbola Desnia. I'm the son of Taiwo Desnia. Um, so my, my, my most fondest memory of Grandma is the time I spent with her, setting up her Nigerian movies for her and watching the Nigerian movies with her and her laughing and me not understanding what's going on in the movies. But I had a great time and I, I wish her eternal peace and I love you, Grandma. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are about to start the program now. The program we are starting now was celebrating the life and times of our dearest mother, grandmother, our wife, aunt, and a great friend. In person of my darling mother, Madam Esther Jokotade Adesoya Ni Akibade. May his sweet soul rest in everlasting peace of the Supreme Almighty God. Amen. Well, we want to start this program, and as you all know, before we start any program, it is important for us to appreciate the presence of the Almighty God in our midst. Because I believe our gathering here today, um, we have the Almighty God present with us, and of course, the person we are celebrating. I am not going to say anything further until I invite my darling sister who is going to declare this event open with special prayers. I'm calling on my darling, beautiful sister, Mrs. Adimbola Oladini. I hope I'm correct. All the way from Ile Ife, the source of the greatest and the greatest and the greatest universe worldwide effort. I hope you by now. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. Can we pray, please? A jackyard bar, a dura. A jackyard bar, a dura, a jackyard, jack, jack, Almighty unknowing God, the King of glory, the one that is the ancient of days, mighty Father, Olorwa, no Olorwa, ni Olorwa, Ibagogo, Opaterek to coin let or to call a baton jay mini mashaber on Nicolari Rala Babaton jay lak by a cabby cabby or mimi mimi woo off the book poor roof joko fish lay a shake a Heavenly Father. We are here again in your presence, Lord. There's nothing we can do without you, Lord. You've been our God from the beginning till now, Father. And you are still going to be our God forever. This particular afternoon, Lord, we commit the remaining program onto your hands, Lord. Sorry, Pekini, but you have a few for you, Peliki, fire, what's up, Bele, you know, working for Lord God Almighty, we pray in one accord in the name of Jesus. 
pe ki e la ibi bayi koja ni oruko Jesu Alagbara nla e la ibi koja ni oruko Jesu we commit everything that we do inside this place onto your hands father we soak everyone into the blood of Jesus and we declare that the blood will begin to speak better things there. More than the blood of Abel. We want to hear your blood speak concerning each and every one of us. Take your place, Lord. Have your way in our midst. And let your name alone be glorified, Father. Because we have prayed in the name of Jesus. Mama, Baba, Misayo, and your love, that was not the least. This should come for us before time. Hello, sir. 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 My grandmother was a very lovely lady. She was someone I adore. She was loving, kind, and given. She, she, she had time for all of us. Even our great-grandchildren, they all adored her when she was alive. I am, I'm, I'm so happy today that none of us was found wanting when she was alive. I, I use this opportunity to just say, God bless all of you for coming. And thank you all so much. Nila Oluno Adesanya, um, son of Taiwo Adesanya and Shola Adesanya. Um, grandma was loved, very smart, very kind. She always cared for her children, gave so gratefully, and she left an impact on all her grandchildren and all her grandchildren. She will be missed, but she's not forgotten. She's one of the greatest women that I have ever known and met. And it's an honor and a privilege to be her grandchild. Cherish the time you spend with your mom, your dad. It is very precious. Please. I enjoy my time with my mom. She's gone now at 92. So please value and try treasure every second with your parents. It is very good, very vital. Again, my master, Joko Tadia, this way. Aurorio, Esmoreo, Okola Mount, Thank you very much. Thank you, ladies and As you can see, the tower just put the pain here this way. I've got much to say because today is a day of long speeches and long talk. Just to make sure that uh, everybody enjoys yourself. Now, and any, anyone that knew my mom here will know that whenever I pass by the house, she will ask me, kill a fed jail, and I'm not going to cook for you. Now, after giving some food to eat, she will also give you takeaway. So I remember my days at the house of Lagos. My roommate was saying, Hey, they want you. I remember my own silver plane. We go every week. My roommate, they are all in that corner there. I went to the house of Lagos. So, my mom, what can I say? Um, When I say pulling the family together, yes, that's one of the things. My late dad was very difficult, right? So my mom said, Baba, it is easy to go in your little kid. Let me just translate that. My mom said, Please don't want to bury me in the jail because I want you to bury me in Lagos where all of you will come. Some of all these people are brought some of us people in Nigeria, but the way it is what it is, basically. And I'm so proud to be one of the children. I'm the last one in the house, but there you go. Um, like I said, there's a lot to say. Of course, to get yourself. Please, I don't say anything. Don't put my brother and say anything. Come on. Anyway, now, yes, I'll be. Now, back to, back to where I'm here. My grandmother, where do I start? She, she's a very lovely lady. You know, one thing about her is, though she didn't go to Minnesota last year or she, but she was very into education. And if you look around, most of what they do are uh, uh, the 
product of our two work in our life. Almost every one of us had the most adequate education you can give to your children. Mama was God sharing. She was loving. She loved both her neighbors, family, children, and her relatives. I'm glad Mama was able to, to see all our great grandchildren. That doesn't come to everyone. I'm proud. And I, an advice I'd like for everyone here is no matter your condition or whatever you do, please look back at your parents. Make sure you take care of them. Make sure you give them what they need. Make the last days of their life worthwhile. Because life is a circle. You start as a child, you go into adulthood, and you go back into infancy. I'd like to appreciate all of you. The fact that you're all there shows how you feel uh, related to my grandmother. I thank you all. I wish you God mercy, and God bless you all. Thank you. Um, today is actually a very emotional day for me because for the past 22 years, this lady has actually been both a mother and a grandmother. We just thank God for her life. I think she's one of the strongest people that I know. Because in spite of everything that's happened to her, she still remains strong. Her faith in the Lord will not. And she still remains committed to ensuring that everybody under her care and watch was treated with respect and dignity and was just able to do what they needed to do to get on the side. Um, for those of you that may not know her personally, as others have come to say, a very generous lady. Within her community, well known. Anybody going past her house, her house was an open door, you come, you get fed. Whenever you go to her, she'll say, feel your magic, feel your magic. And for those of you that know my grandma, her effort was the baddest effort we can ever taste. Her effort grew. <laughs> so I would definitely miss that. <laughs> um, as I say, I thank God for her life. And I thank God that she has left a legacy because truly, this lady that birthed six children, who gave birth to 22 grandchildren and 25 great grandchildren, and more coming. That is something that we really need to celebrate and just thank God. So thank you all. Thank you.
I'm her grandson. Every time I'll come back from school, grandma will always be there. And she'll make sure that I eat and make sure that I'm fine. Every time she needs something, she'll ask me to go get it for her. And when she needs to wash her hands or carry her bags or go for a walk, she'll always ask for me first to go with her, and I will. So, yeah, she was a very caring person. My name is Femi Opening my mouth, press on my mouth. When I see that, I see me. Book boy, I'm on me. Yeah, you look. You know, when the monk on the song, my money, oh, fair round, my. Oh, the fair round, quite. Book 
gbogbo wa so n se kini ni nuts nkan kan ti re ruwe so lo kire nkan kan ko fo ra won omo isere asawa in lo ze so n ta kan le so ni pe olorun gbe sa fe fe re ah my prayer for the children that they show be united and uh, continue the good memory of mama thank you
But she was kind as well. And um, I'll miss our generosity towards my family, especially my dad. There is no time that she doesn't look out for my dad and always sending him present whenever she's back from the US. And also, my children, they learned Yoruba from her when, the, when she was in the US with us. We miss her so much and we love her. May our gentle soul rest in peace. Amen. I'll miss her, my Iru because every time she sees anybody coming to the US, she makes the roof for me and Ogi. And she will send it to me. And she calls me Omo Mi Olushola. I'll miss that as well. And I love her so much. May our gentle soul rest in peace. In Jesus' name. Amen. Oh, 
MC, 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 Oh, 